Hello guys, Igor here doing one more Epsom review and today is a special review where we are going to analyze and sell done. I'm not going to do only one review. We are going to do a series of reviews because this tool is, has a lot of toolbox inside them. It's a business OS, so it's more complex than Shopify in a way that they will create their own integrations. They will not use apps as integrations that you need to, you know, spend more money with it. It's a business OS that you have everything you need to, to run an e-commerce store. So there's a lot of features, a lot of things to learn. I want to do a true tutorial about sell done and you can expect more than one review. So again, we're not gonna um, see everything about sell done in that video, on that video. We have, we'll have a series of videos that I will launch until tomorrow, uh, maybe four or five videos about sell done where we will go in depth of those functionalities. What is sell done? It's claiming to be a, uh, to run your offline and online store with an advanced business OS. What does it mean? It means that it's not only an e-commerce platform, it will have all the features you need to run your business. It's an alternative to big commerce. Seldon is an advanced business OS that helps you start selling online and offline without plugins, templates, or coding. That's the thing you need to know. If you have an, only an e-commerce platform, you need to buy plugins, buy templates, buy some integrations that require some coding. And with sell done, no, you have the whole business OS inside it. So you don't need anything more, only sell done to run your business. Okay. Uh, they are planning for people from South America. They're going with the South American payment gateways like Mercado Pago and Peg Seguro. So you can expect many different payment gateways. Uh, they are they, they are uh, told that wants to be global. There is a difference here toward the tiers. So the company plan will get tier one and tier two. And enterprise plan gets the tier three updates. Okay. So if you want to get the enterprise enterprise plan, so getting all the features, you need to buy the tier three. The tier three is the best one of those because you get the community builder, drop shipping, and marketplace and multi vendor. So again, if you need the drop shipping feature, try to get the tier three. The tier three is the best one for scaling your business. You get more stores and unlimited means. The difference so are the plan. So if you get the company plan, you will not get the enterprise plan features in the future. The transaction fee is the same, 1%. It's reasonable. And the digital file transac transaction fee will be different in the enterprise plan. Okay. So in the enterprise plan is 3%. That's why I think the license tier tree is the way to go because when you sell, you know, five different digital file fees, uh, some, not five, but some of the, your digital files, you will, you know, get that value uh, compensated by the transaction fee. That's only 3%. And you get more stores, so five stores with those unique features, the possibility to run a community inside, sell them the drop shipping feature that everybody loves, and marketplace and multi vendors. Okay, so that's seldom. They have 36 positive reviews right now on AppSumo, which is rare nowadays. And what I'm gonna say is you have only 11 days to get seldom. So I'm gonna help you with my new reviews. We'll have more than one, I'm repeating it. We'll, we'll have we'll have more than one. We are going on that that one only see the first uh, the, the first aspects of the tool, and in the next one I'm gonna divide 
you know, the, the videos by topics inside Seldon. So, okay, I'm here on my account. I'm going to show you the dashboard. Okay. And let's see that here you can select your shops. Okay. I have two demo shops here that I'm going to use to show the tool for you. And to create a new shop, you just click here and you start the process of shopping creating. Remember, they are multi-language. So look here, the number of language that you have inside Seldon. Okay. They are multi-language. You have Portuguese, you have Spanish, they have France, French, Deutsch, etc. Okay. A lot of languages, even language that I don't know. Yoruba is here. Pretty cool. But first, let's check out the features that you will find on your account. So on personal information profile, you're going to see your email address. You can set up your mobile numbers. Why are you going to set your mobile number to make your account safer? Okay. So you can verify your, your mobile number, your account will be safer. Address, you're going to see your valid transactions as well, ID and uh, all the features of the main profile. Your profile will be public available to anyone. So you can create an about, select your website. You have a public profile to show up using Seldon. On wallets and accounts, okay, let's see which kind of wallet you can create by now. Okay, you can change your unit here. Those are the units available. There are a lot. Okay, I have Brazilian Reels, English, Switzerland, Colombia. That's everything here. Okay, you're going to find your country here for sure. If you don't, just send an email to the guys. They will add in no time. After you create your wallet, the one you're going to use on your store to receive your money, you can set up your payment gateways. The process of creating a new store in Seldon is pretty simple. You just click on create a new store and you're going to select the title, the language. They are multi-language. Select your store name, description, contact information, and your logo. Doing that, you will be ready to have a store inside Seldon. After that, you should add your payment gateway. So as you can see here, you're going to see many different tabs where you're going to uh, customize our store and add your automations and your marketing strategies, etc. But to add a new pay payment gateway, you go here on accounting and go to gateway and you're going to select new payment methods. By now, they have Stripe, PayPal, cash on delivery, cash payment, bank transfer, and quick pay. They have promised to add many others payment gateway in the future. Also, the specific ones related to some kind of regions in the world. For instance, they know that in Latin America, people use a lot Mercado Pago and PagSeguro, and they, are, uh, they said that they will add specific payment gateways in the future. After you connect to your payment gateways, it is advisable to connect your custom domain. To do that, just go to settings and select domain. Click on add a new domain and you will be able to connect your custom domain. They recommend Cloudflare to connect the SSL, but if you have any problem during the process, they advise you to uh, contact the support team. To add new products on Seldon is pretty simple. Just go here on products and you create here on new products. You can select between physical product, virtual, file. So all permitted files like online course videos, downloadable documents, or ser service, okay? So for instance, let's say you want to sell an online course. You go here, you're going to select your category, product name, a product code, which is optional, the number, if units, item, etc., and so on. You'll be able to see the SEO preview of your product while, you're, while you are adding uh, the details of it. So you're going to add the general info, uh, you you can add a survey. So, uh, your customers will be able to rate your product. 
for instance, good quality, good value, etc. You can enter the features of the products, okay? Run, for instance, course, advanced, okay? And cons, on specifications, you can add any technical specifications that you need to that product. You can add here a picture of your product. You can also use YouTube to add a video about your product and also add, uh, add image galleries here. You can set up the price, the product descriptions as well, summary, page title, specifying the URL. You're gonna see everything here. And here you're gonna write the title and the content. Also, you can add FAQ about your course and also create uh, an structured, uh, structured data uh, for your product. You can see here that they have many kinds of tutorials. And as you can see uh, in Saldon, is that they are really worried about the SEO and to create a way that you're gonna rank your product on Google, okay? So it's possible to create an structured data for your product, in that case, the course. You can upload your files here, okay? If you're gonna sell a course, and you can, of course, uh, sell different kind of products, even service. For instance, if you wanna sell a, a teaching, an online class, a live online class, a teaching opportunity, or if you want to share, uh, to sell a consultancy, you can sell your service here, and you can see that they have the same features as well with some difference. For instance, here, you can add a message to users when uh, they will be purchasing your product. You can select the service type, if, if it's subscription, if it's an appointment, if it's a booking, okay? I'm giving you an overall overview of the product tab of Saldon, but in the future, I'm gonna go explaining you the best way to fill out all the space here in Seldon. I'd like to remember you again that Seldon is not only an e-commerce tool because you're not supposed to use a large bunch of plugins or apps to develop your business. It's instead business OS tool. All the marketing, sales, campaigns, ads, and automation tools are pre-integrated and ready to use in your dashboard. That's why, for instance, you have a blog feature inside Zelda, and it's pretty easy to use. You can create new categories clicking here and write new blog posts click here on the top left. You click here to write a new blog post. You can choose the URL, the page title, summary. You can schedule the publication or publish now. Select the category and write the text here. You can upload image, YouTube URL, HTML, doing comparison, comparison catalog and canvas. You also can create FAQ on your blog post and structure the data. When you finish a blog post, it will look like that. Pretty cool, all right? Again, that's only the first part of my review. On the next step, I'm gonna show you the templates, how you can structure your store, and also the kind of automation and marketing tool that you're gonna find inside Seldon. I hope you like that review. Please, if you like it, click on the link in the description to help me to keep going. Thank you, bye-bye.